was happy with my first group because I was able to play my bench, a lot of them in double figure minutes, and I thought we had some uh, we had some good action. I thought uh, Jackson came in, Lumpkin, Lumpkin was pretty solid the whole ball game, and uh, Coop hit that last three, which she needed because she struggled a little defensively, but she can run my offense. But Danny Williams and Hillsman and Curtis, they did a heck of a job. Those three can score some points. We can run some sets, but uh, we played the team a lot smaller than us. We won't see that when we play Texas Tech on Thursday. So hopefully we can get some people out here to the ball game on Thursday night. It's an old Southwest Conference rival. Hey, that's my alma mater, and I'd like nothing more than to have 6,000 in here on Thursday night. It was a very good team win. You know, we came out focused, and we, know, we knew what we had to do. We started out on defense a little slow, but then we picked it up, and I don't think we look back. That's what we have to have. You know, we're not going to have just one person just scoring tons every night. So he's really been talking about everybody do a little bit and chip in, and we'll be a team that way. It gives us a lot of confidence, you know, starting 1-0 and and knowing that they were in the NCAA tournament. It gives us a good feeling going into Tech because we know that they're going to be good. There's no egos, okay? They play together as a team. They cheer for each other. You see our bench. The girl that got the least amount of minute, Jazz Williams, she was the biggest cheerleader on the bench. And that's what you got to have while you're learning the game, trying to get better. You've got to be able to be a good teammate before you can be a good player. And when that happens, we're all on that same boat. We're going to have to work and work and work. But this is hopefully the first of many wins this year. But they're going to be a little bit harder this year because we're having to create some offense. And then I thought Kyla did a pretty good job in there passing out of double teams. Uh, she ended up, oh gosh, she had six turnovers. We'll talk about that. But she's got to learn to pass out before the double team gets there. But she gave me four blocks, shot 50%, made her free throws, 11 rebounds. That's a double-double. I can live with that every day. I'll work on the turnovers.